Off for a ride with Chris today. Exploration day, hey? I'm the rating. <laughs> I'll follow you. Yeah, I'll, I'll take you. Follow me. And then get in front after. Ooh, nice Mustang. We're just going to go out and explore some of the tracks west of uh, Brisbane. It's got a little bit of aerial surveillance using Google Maps and Gaia. And we reckon we found some good stuff to ride on. So we're going to go out and check it out and see, see how it all looks. We're not here to fuck spiders. Oh, I went out last night. Um, I probably shouldn't have known I was riding today. And, whew, I don't know, probably drank the better part of half a carton of beer. <laughs> so I'm a bit, uh, yeah, yeah, a bit flat this morning. I need to sweat it out of me. Must be a lot of people around here with sore backs. There's bloody massage places all over the shop. <laughs> There's another one just there. I think maybe they're doing more than uh, fixing people's backs. Yeah, I hope the fucking track isn't too gnarly today. I just, oh, I vomit. Oh, I'm just so, uh, yeah, teetering. I'm not over the limit. I blew into the. Um, I got a pretty good breathalyzer. That's meant to be um, yeah, suitable for use in Australia. It's not a cheap Chinese one. <clears throat> and I blew zero this morning, so yeah, it's just lack of energy, I think. Yeah, so on the satellite uh, image and the GPS data that we looked at, um, looks like it could be quite a bit of fun out here. There's tracks that are called Scorpion Hill and Rock Bottom Road. <laughs> um, yeah, a whole bunch of gnarly names. I can't remember the rest of them, but it just makes you think like there might be some um, four-wheel drive tracks out there. It's actually quite a nice day today. It's Oh, beautiful house, yeah, old Queenslander. Um, yeah, it's top of 24 today and we got this nice cloud cover, so we're really starting to get into these nicer, um, nicer months now. Oh boy! Definitely got to stop drinking before going out for rides the next day. <laughs> okay, so we're getting close to these hills up here. That's a no-go zone, mate. That's a mountain bike area. You know all those ones like rock bottom and... Oh, mountain bike, is it? Yeah, have you been here? I think I've done a wedding out here once. Yeah, My brother, we just go... I'll cut across to Lockyer, I guess, and push out that way. Yep, we just go down here for a bit. I think next petrol station we pass, I'll get a V. Oh, really? I need to fire the brain up, I reckon. Okay, well, that's unfortunate. Uh, mountain bike trails. Mountains out here look pretty good. I don't know how far away they are, they don't look that far away. Maybe, maybe 20 k's. Camels, <laughs> next 12 kilometers. Awesome. I haven't 
haven't seen a camel out in the wild before. Ah, yes, it says it's an oath through road, but a lot of the times it just gets a bit rough, so they put a no through road sign on it when it does actually go through. We might have to do a little bit of trailblazing. It's not working well enough for this. Oh, and there's something in my helmet. Yep. Ah, get out of there. I can fly buzzing in my ear. Ah. Oh, so fucking annoying. Get out. Ah. Yeah. I'm not, not in the mood for this today. Oh, oh shit, that hurt. Ow. <laughs> Back just stepped out but killed my ribs. Oh. Well, any other day I would love this. Oh, I really don't want to come off again with this rib hurting like it is. I don't know, I've been even harping on about the rib, but it's fucking sore. My balance isn't the best at the moment. It really does, um, yeah, affect your confidence when you're having off. Oh, fuck. That's a big... It's... When I was riding along last weekend, it just sort of, yeah, front just gave out, slipped out on me and caught me by surprise. Chris is having a great old time. Oh, this is the shit we normally go looking for. Come on, Scott, suck it up. You can enjoy yourself. Oh. Turn this ABS off. <laughs> oh, I'm in the wrong fucking. Oh, not going up there, she's too slippery. <sighs> oh, I want to go down that. Oh, fuck. <sighs> oh, 
as long as we don't have to ride up this. I'm not in the mood for it, I'm afraid. Oh, what are you doing, Scott? Oh, shit. I feel like a fucking newbie at the moment. I'm just struggling. Oh, I know where I need to be, I just can't get there. <sighs> Fuck. <laughs> the fucking bike's too fucking high. <sighs> Far out. I don't recommend. I don't recommend doing this sport when you're hungover. It's hard work. <sighs> oh. I tell you, I'm struggling today. <laughs> hey? Ah, uh, well, not sure. Yeah, would have been normally. This is some uh, feeling a bit fragile today. <laughs> well, that was good. Like any other day, it would have been like, oh, yeah, bring it on. <laughs> Sandy too, okay. <clears throat> Fuck. Oh shit. Oh. <laughs> That's how it's done, I guess. Let me guess it up. <laughs> take the chicken track <laughs> sorry mate that just not float my boat at the moment <laughs> yeah shit not today you can have a go but nah <laughs> Don't want to help you push it out. Alright, oh, no, so this is a bit of a four wheel drive playground by the look of it. Oh, yeah, I could have gone up that way, I guess. Three levels there by the look of it. I'm taking the easy one. through there, I probably should have. Oh. Oh. 
Um, Is. Oh, I don't know how he got up there, okay. Oh, I can do that. Oh, is this guy coming down here now, is he? I feel like a wolf today. Okay. Oh, crikeys. Lots of moaning and groaning coming out of me today. <laughs> okay, so just turned on to Miller's Road and we're coming into the Lockyer, Lockyer National Park now. Now this is a um, pretty gnarly track at the best of times. There's been a lot of rain in recent months so um, a little bit worried, there's some there's about four creek crossings in there that could be pretty deep now. And uh, yeah, and even at its best, it's um, there's some spots there that are just yeah, super gnarly. So hopefully, anyway, we'll see what happens, see what it looks like. Chris has been out here once before, he said. I'm not sure if he was on his Africa Twin or not. Um, but anyway, Chris can handle that Africa Twin pretty well, so he should uh, struggle. But um, yeah, I'm a bit um, getting a bit nervous at the moment riding into this. I ended up having a can of V, so I've sparked up a little bit. Hopefully, I can um, pick my lines quick enough now. Hey. God, little creek crossing straight off the bat. Uh, that's uh, never been there before, so that's a new one. Oh, lots of sand in here. Oh, wow, this is really rutted in here. Look at that, jeez. That is not a good sign of things to come. Wow! <laughs> oh my god! This thing is completely re-sculpted! This was, this was quite a decent road through here at one point. Oh uh, no, well, I'm, I'm still recording. Yeah, um, I'll follow you. <laughs> Oh, I don't know about that. I might stay up here. Yeah, I reckon we're going to have a real hard time with this now. Looking at this, this was a normal road. And it's just um, completely gone now. Wow. Had a log over and everything. <laughs> oh, this is going to be interesting. 
this is about as rocky as I remember it. It's a good thing. <laughs> I got it quite stiff at the moment, so there's no real deflections coming off these big rocks. Oh, maybe she's too stiff now. Fuck me! Oh. <laughs> oh, that was scary. Oh, let me let me get the fucking. I gotta clean my pants out after that. Oh. Yeah, I'll just loosen these up a bit now. That's um. Oh, that was scary. I <laughs> thought I was going down the bank then. Wow, this is super smooth. I wonder what happened here to smooth this out. Jeez, this is messy. This is a completely different beast now. Oh, I've never seen that there before. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> yeah, this is completely new. Uh, not a fan of this soft sand stuff. Oh yeah, that's pretty easy. <laughs> okay, well they're low. Bit of clutch modulation there. Pretty happy with that. <laughs> I got the soft clutch on there now, so it's only the second ride since I put it on. Pretty happy with it, to be honest. I wonder how this creek's looking. Huh, dry. low, really low. Well, it's a whole different creek crossing now. Jeez.
challenges. Well, these are a damn lot easier than the creeks we crossed in last weekend. That's all I can say. Uh, this one's not particularly nice though. And again, I was modulating my clutch a little then. Oh shit, I get down there. I don't have traction control on this bike. Yeah. I'll be riding my Tiger soon. I'll be riding my Tiger soon. I got the, um, I got a, I should, probably should have showed you before. I got a Tiger 900 rally. And I'm just waiting for a few parts to come from overseas to get it, to get it registered. Yeah. So better suspension than this. It's a lower seat, but it's got more clearance. So, because this is one thing about this bike and the gnarly stuff, I feel like I teeter a little bit. It'd be nice to be able to plant my feet. Yeah. Yeah. And I'm just starting to get a rhythm now for this. My dirt legs, so to speak. I think I finally shook that hangover. <laughs> mm -hmm. Wow, this flood water has just annihilated this. Look at it. Oh. This is new. Oh man, I don't like this. I don't like this. Go in there. Ah. starts to get gnarly up here. That was the stuff that scared me. Oh, this isn't much better. Yeah, I think that what Chris was saying about dropping the sprocket or putting an extra tooth on the front sprocket could be good for this. Enhance my gnarly experience. Coming out here riding on my own, it's pretty silly when you think about it. I felt I needed yeah, a little bit more down low, it would have been good. I'll do it, definitely. We'll come back out here once I do it.
get a break. Holy mackerel. Oh, I don't want to lose my run up here. I'm going to wait for Chris to get up and around it. as bad as I remember it's no worse there uh, these rock gardens can always be fucking painful uh, especially when you got a cracked rib uh, yeah front sprocket would be a good one to change because then I could just put it in my pocket if I do uh, go to Cape York for example I could just keep the long legs on until I get up there, pull it out of my pocket, throw the, the taller gearing on. Taller gearing, shorter gearing. Anyway, the lower. Now I've got more, more go down low. Um, and there, then do, so do a gnarly track and then swap it over. That'd be great, actually. Some big mud fields up here. I dare say they're dried out by now, I would hope. <laughs> Sand. I am getting better at the sound though. used to be like almost paralyzed in fear from it it was that <laughs> it was that bad yeah, Cape York trip uh, quickly cured that I did come down here once actually. Um, was I on my own or I might have been with Fred? Wow, hey. <laughs> I went down here once and there was nothing at the end, it was just a turning point. The next uh, right's pretty good. <laughs> I 
Whoa! Three, two, one. Oh, my rib. Oh, fuck that hurt. Oh, yeah, I'll have to jibby it up the hill here, I think. And yep. I'll do your trick. I'll go up here. Guys, girls, bit of fun up there. Ah, oh. uh, bugger. insect in my helmet again. Fucking annoying. Ah, just shut up. Sit still. Ah. Ah. Oh, okay, gotta pull over, gotta pull over, gotta pull over. Ah, get out. Get out. Ah. Fucking insects. Oh, that's fun through there, eh? Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah, this is it. I'll follow you. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, I got my bike on this way once before, too. Oh, you did? Yeah, because I had to drive on. Oh, okay. Nothing happened. Oh, this is a bitch of a hill. Oh, 
know he's doing well. I'm pussyfooting it. Wow, this is a whole new hill now. It's very different. Oh, oh, oh. Fuck! Uh, fuck! Oh, fuck! Ah! Uh, c- uh, 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 oh, Michael! Oh! Oh! Uh, oh! Oh, shit! Where's the horn? Where's the horn? Where's the horn? Oh, no! Oh, fuck! Oh shit, man! Fuck! Ah! Ah! Fuck! Oh, my horn doesn't fucking work anymore. It's not twisted to breaking point, but fuck it hurts. Ah! It's right on the. I'm gonna be walking funny. Oh my god, so fucking scary man, I'm out here, I've ridden this by myself before, and I've fallen over here before, <sighs> at least I know I've got someone coming for me now, soon, hopefully, sooner than later, <sighs> oh, I just need a little weight off that back of the bike, and then, I might be able to jibby out. Oh, if this route wasn't here, I would have gone down that little bit further. I reckon I would have twisted it to breaking point. Why oh, isn't my horn working? That's what I want to know. Must have got fucked up when it went in the water. Oh, shit, that hurts. Shit, this is killing me. Come on, Chris, I need help. Chris! Chris! Oh, fuck. I need a hand! I'm pinned! I wonder if I can pull my foot out of the boot. Oh... Make a tragedy. You did? No, uh, if I do. Oh shit. Dude. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> okay, you ready? Yep. Oh, oh, thank fuck. Oh, thank you. Okay, I've got to move, eh? Oh, I'm out. You can lay it down again now. Yeah? No, I don't know. Okay, right there. Oh no, it's got my heel now. Yep. Oh. You're going to have to bring a little bit more. Oh, got it. Oh, good. Oh, fuck, that was painful. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, was your camera rolling then when you come up? Oh. Yeah, yeah. Ah. Yeah. Oh. Ah. To find you pinned. Oh. oh, my toes were just getting crushed. <sighs> the twist, the twist hurt to start with, yeah. but then after twisted for so long, it kind of eased up, but then the toe. Ah. <sighs> <sighs> Oh, my groin. You want to push? Woo! Woo! Right there. Ready? Three, two, one. Traction control off. You got your traction off? All right, three, one. Uh, no, I think it just washed out on me. <sighs> oh, yeah, should be. Uh, three, right there. Uh, th- three, two, one. <sighs> Here first. <laughs> I knew this fucking hill would get me. Oh, fucking 
fuel lights. <sighs> Blinking. Shit. Oh, this is fucking too much for me, man. What is that? Oh, something's wrong with these brakes. Is it my brakes or my just traction? a lot better going downhill than me. <laughs> Shit, the front nearly went out on me again. What an ordeal! <laughs> that was uh, yeah, that hill, man. It fucks me every time. Nice yeah, it's easier going up for sure. <sighs> Big weakness of mine, I think, is my downhill ride. I'm wakeboarded. Wake. Yeah, so you just like I just go down and I'm like and I'm on the brake and if it's locking up I just like put my weight on the inside peg. On this side and lay it down. down. No, I just go yeah, it goes. Uh, I just lay it up the hill. Mm. And then it's really easy to pick it up. Mm-hmm. Rather than if you like go if you go down the hill that way then you can screw the bike around. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Alright. Okay mate. Thanks. Awesome thanks ride. for the ride, yeah. I come good there at the end. I did enjoy all this part through here. Well, the, that was the only part to really enjoy, actually. Well, you know, the stuff this morning was nice and gnarly, and I would have normally enjoyed it, but I was just like having a, I was struggling with it. After that V, you were fine, eh? Yeah, the V and the sausage roll picked me up. All right, thanks for the ride. Sorry, I can't come back in the bridge. You no, you're right. You're yeah, yeah, two birds, one stone. That's my philosophy. What's that? Two birds, one stone. Oh, yeah. Alright, right. cheers man. Yeah, so major problem I have with my riding is my 
my downhill riding especially the really loose steep downhill riding Yeah, I don't know what I would have done then. Knowing Chris was there, I guess I didn't squiggle and squirt too much. But that boot was um, definitely, you know, I was wedged proper. Um, only other thing I would have tried is unbuckling my boot, all the straps, and trying to um, pull my foot out. But that would have been quite painful because the angle my, um, my ankle was twisted at wouldn't have wanted to come out uh, like it normally would have when you put it on and off so I don't know if that would have worked uh, I didn't squiggle and squirm because I knew Chris would have come eventually and then also knew I also knew that I had that possibility that if that handlebar slid fuck me went into that too hot okay where am I going that way yeah